Hello and uh, welcome to Jesus College. My name is Berta Bert and I'm a tutorial fellow in biology at the college. Um, and in this in this short video, I'm going to talk a little bit about the college, um, our community, and and biology as at Jesus. So I'll start with a very short history of Jesus College in Oxford. Our college was founded in 1571 by Queen Elizabeth I. This here is the portrait of Queen Elizabeth that presides the, the hall in college. Um, our college has been linked to Wales ever since its um, inauguration, thanks to Hugh Price, who was a Welsh churchman and lawyer, who was very important in the establishment of the college. The main buildings um, of the college are right in the centre of Oxford. Um, it's a shame that the open day isn't happening this year, so I thought I'd show you a couple of photos. This here is the first quad, which has some of the oldest buildings in college, which date back to the 16th and 17th century. Then we have the second quad, which was added shortly afterwards at the turn of the 18th century. And the college since then hasn't stopped um, expanding and growing and in fact we are right now in the process of building another another building in in our in our central location so it's a really interesting and dynamic time to be to be joining the college the community at jesus so I, i'd say that jesus is a very friendly college. We have around 350 undergraduate students and 230 graduate students. And then we have around 80 fellows and 45 college lecturers. Both, both the tutorial and student bodies are very international with people coming from a range of different backgrounds and, and cultures. I myself, for example, I come from Spain um, the college also has historically always had a higher than average proportion of UK students coming from state schools, something that we're maintaining and that we're very proud of. And every year we welcome six biology undergraduate students uh, to the college. So a little bit about biology at Jesus. Biology has a strong tradition um, in the college and this is evident from the permanent association of the college with two very important professorships, that's the whole professorship and the professor, professorship of zoology. Professor Tim Colson, who is the co-head of the zoology department, is our current professor of zoology, and Sir Charles, Professor Sir Charles Godfrey is our current HOPE professor. He is also the director of the Oxford Martin School and of the Oxford Martin Programme on the Future of Food. Our previous principal, Lord John Krebs, is also a biologist and he is famous for his research in the fields of behavioural ecology and ornithology. There are four of us in the tutorial team uh, for biology and our job is to ensure um, and support our students to make sure that they can achieve uh, their academic goals and academic excellence but also it's our job to support them and provide them with uh, pastoral care. And we have two lecturers in biology, Dr. Rebecca Toth who is a plant developmental biologist and she's interested in the cellular processes during stress responses in land plants. Uh, Dr. Elisa McLean, our other lecturer in biology, studies symbiosis, symbiotic interactions between insects and bacteria. Professor Graham Taylor is one of our tutorial fellows and his group focuses on the dynamics and control of animal flights. And I am the other tutorial fellow and my group studies um, developmental processes and their evolution using cichlid fish, fishes as a model organism. So I hope that you can see that between the four of us, we, of course, we don't cover the whole of biology, but we cover a lot of it, which means that as a team, we are particularly well placed to support 
the interests of, of our students and, and help them and give them guidance. Um, so that's, that's all from me. And I'm going to leave you with, with a word from, from our students. Thank you so much for watching. Hi, my name is Lydia. I'm a first year biology student at um, Jesus College. Um, and I, when I first arrived at Oxford, I was sort of worried about this culture shock because I grew up in the US and sort of there's this transition between the US and the UK and then also high school and uh, university that I was just quite scared of. Um, and I thought that it would be really difficult to transition between the two. Um, but I found that at Jesus, everyone was really nice and really helpful. Um, and during Freshers' Week, you sort of are welcomed into this like new community that is just really kind. Um, and it sounds cheesy to say that the people at Jesus are my favorite part of it, but they really are. Um, and, you know, I think that anybody thinking of applying to uh, Oxford should really consider the various uh, cultures that different colleges have and I think that Jesus just has an overwhelmingly nice one um, and I think that that is really hard to find anywhere um, and I think that it's really valuable within the college. Um, in terms of biology at, all, at Jesus, um, we have quite a, you know, extensive faculty, uh, like a lot of biology fellows at Jesus um, and they span quite a broad range of subjects and so you really get to benefit from that especially in first year when most of your tutorials are in college um, sort of two or three on one with experts um, I find that you know whatever you put into tutorials you get that out and more um, and it's been really beneficial to have um, a lot of people doing biology at Jesus because you have this sort of sub community within the really nice community of Jesus um, and yeah, I mean, Biology Jesus has been great and I've really enjoyed it. Hi, um, my name's Nick and I'm a second year biologist at Jesus College. And I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about what it's like studying in Jesus. Um, so granted, my course will be different to the one you're applying for since I'm second year and the course changed last year. But I think, you know, there are some things which have really changed throughout the years when it comes to uh, studying biology or just studying in general in Jesus. So, um, my favorite thing about Jesus is that it's a small college. Um, well, it's a relatively small college. It hasn't got the biggest quads like Keeble or like um, Christchurch. Um, but that, like, I think that means we have a really, really tight knit community. Um, and, you know, not just with biology, but in general. But, um, like, a lot of, uh, when, if you, a lot of activities overlap in Jesus um, in terms of like the members of the JCR, undergrads and MCR, postgrads. Um, and you get to meet a lot of different people just by being around and you don't, you're don't you not confined just to undergrads since everyone is just so close together. Uh, so I mean, I mean, if you do rowing, you will have been able to um, meet uh, MCR members or just maybe art activities. Um, and it's just good to, it's, it's of course, you know, the, the undergrads are great and you get to, you know, your your own course mate um, will become one of the great, greatest friends you have in Oxford. But um, it's all good to just to have a different perspective from um, old members, maybe also doing biology. Um, apart from that, I guess she's also quite close to the lecture hall, but I think also made doesn't really matter since it's a nice walk there. You get to go to the Natural History Museum. Like, it's worth it either way, where, wherever you are, but um, I guess ultimately all the colleges are different in terms of studying biology uh, or just studying in general and like a lifestyle but I think if you prefer a tight-knit community and you don't mind it being too small, pick Jesus. <laughs>